I kind of walked in and I was like, wow, the arched ceiling and the natural skylights. It's almost a little cathedral of a gimmick the kite, if you will. It just got my, got my juices flowing, the wheels turning. This is a traditional Munich style beer hall, and we're really only a few blocks from the original uh, Kuster or brewery on the other side of the river. We'll have uh, some things uh, familiar and some things not. We'll be launching our West Side Ale, and that is a Dampfbier, which is a historical uh, 19th century uh, German beer. We're drinking Reinheitsgebot, award-winning German Bavarian style beers. So our beer is malt, water, hops, yeast, that's it. So the entire rainbow of flavors that you're getting from the glass here is really coming from a different combination and a little uh, brew house magic of those four ingredients. We are a small winemaker and a small distillery, so there are things other than beer. This is not the full restaurant experience. This is more snack style fare that you might find in a German deli and maybe a few things that you might find here in the U.S. as well. A picture of the Berlin Wall coming down, the old the version of the Grand Rapids Brewing Company number three. Little bits and pieces and little conversation starters. Part of the fun will be finding some of the nuggets in here. I mean we try to do a, a few little small interesting things. This is our Stammtisch table where our members, our, our mug members would be able to sit. You know, I've been carrying around boxes of coasters from my travels for um, 20, 30 years or more. <laughs> and so we've put, uh, put a use to some of these things. The Stein lockers is from Germany. Some of the artwork and then Steins here as well. Those will all be German made. All the furniture, all the woodwork, everything else has been done locally. Hello world. This is a labor of love, obviously. I, I you know, did this because I love this culture and we had started this before the pandemic. So obviously there were some setbacks, there were some changes between supply chain and labor issues, et cetera. It's been a bit of an odyssey, but here we are. We're certainly really, really excited to get the doors open and show people what we've done. Mm -hmm.